it's kids for a quid mm. on Saturday. Always a nice little occasion, that, isn't it? Are you looking forward to welcoming some of the younger generation of supporters, Dan? Yeah, I think so. As I say, um, you know, to, to have something like that, to, to enable people to bring a more cost-effective way of bringing young supporters through through the turnstiles, has got to be fantastic for the football club. You know, we've, d- we've done certain initiatives in regard to, you know, half-terms, bringing people in, watching training. We've had a few thousand people at a time doing that, and I think the opportunity, certainly on match days as well, to make things more more cost effective for people is fantastic yeah it's the family thing isn't it Stuart it's not just yeah. you know extra kids coming down it's it's more of a you know a day out for the whole family yeah as I say I mean the big thing for, for a lot of people and a lot of families is well, by the time you pay for two adults and two children all of a sudden and a program some food and, and one thing and another becomes very very expensive you know so, but uh, with the opportunity with kids for a quid you know all of a sudden that becomes a very cost effective day always a special occasion I suppose when the youngsters get in a bit cheaper it's uh, well, it's better, isn't it? Uh, hopefully, hopefully, a lot of the kids will come down and, and bring a positive mood uh, and, and vibe to the to the stadium, to the ground, which is uh, which is really important for us. You know, uh, it's um, and it would be good to give them something back as well. You know, uh, if we can give them three points, then we'll have a hell of a day, and then that's what we're looking forward to do. How much of a learning experience is it as well for, for young aspiring footballers in terms of actually coming to, to enjoy a match day experience and to watch professional championship players up close? I think it's vital. I mean, you, that's where you get your role models from, you know. I know when I was growing up, you know, I used to go to Queen's Park Rangers and all of a sudden you're watching the next hero and you try to emulate them and, and you know, try and mimic their style of play, if you like, in certain areas of the pitch. And, and that is, that's what gets you hooked straight away and wants you to be a footballer and then from there obviously hopefully you go up and through through the food chain. Let's hope there's a good result to inspire them even more. Let's hope so.